voice? Our voice. Whose voice? Our voice. Whose schools? Our schools. Whose schools? Our schools. This is how Guilford County teachers started their day, calling on lawmakers to pass a state budget. And the education funding that goes with it. The state budget is at least 90 days overdue. So how does this impasse affect teachers and students? We're digging deeper. So here's the deal. No state budget means no public school budget. And keep in mind, there's been there's been over a month. It's been over a month, excuse me, since school started in North Carolina. So how did we get here? In May, a two year budget bill cleared the House after several hours of debate and dozens of proposed amendments. Then Governor Roy Cooper vetoed the House bill because it didn't include the Medicaid expansion nor school funding increase in his recommended budget. Later in September, House Republicans held a vote on a veto override. Here's the thing. Most Democrats were not in their seats. That caused a lot of controversy and national uproar. But the veto override is still in the House and headed to the Senate. The Republican majority only needs one Democrat to vote with them, and the budget becomes law. In a statement, Governor Cooper shared he has, quote, offered a reasonable compromise and North Carolinians deserve better than Republican obstruction and excuses. Meanwhile, Senator Phil Berger shared with us that, quote, Governor Cooper has vetoed every teacher pay raise passed by the legislature since he's been governor. Again, the veto override still in the House and has to pass in Senate before it becomes law. So in the meantime, teachers say schools are using funds from last year's budget to make do. Thanks, Laura. Higher pay is something teachers across the country have been fighting for for years. But what do the numbers say? The National Education Association found the national average starting teacher salary is about $39,000. That's around $19 an hour if you look at it that way. Here in North Carolina, the average starting salary is a little lower at $37,000.